If you haven't made your stuffing for Thanksgiving yet, follow me for a recipe. My sister gave me an amazing stuffing recipe. My sister Wadi, she's an excellent cook. So follow me for this delicious Caribbean stuffing recipe. My oven isn't big enough to cook a turkey for Thanksgiving, but I can make the stuffing for Thanksgiving. So here is my stuffing recipe. I start with a roll of Jimmy Dean regular sausage. A stick, a whole stick of butter. I season with a little salt, pepper, complete seasoning, oregano leaves garlic powder and onion powder. I know it's a lot of seasoning, but it's very tasty when it's complete. And now I chop up some celery, onion, sweet pepper, chives. I don't chop the thyme, I put the thyme in in stalks because it gives it a really good flavor and on the end you can just pick it out of the stuffings because most people don't like the little crunchy stalks from the time so this I will add into the butter and the Jimmy Dean sausage For a lot of time because the thyme gives it a really good flavor and when you're ready to eat it you can just pick out the stalks out of the stuffing. In a separate bowl I mix two eggs and whip the eggs first and then I add chicken broth, chicken stock and then add my bag of stuffing into it and I use the cube stuffing so that it don't come too mushy. I'll add it together in this bowl while everything is cooking in the pot, the sausage and all the veggies. And then I take the stuffing mix and I add it to the mixture just for a little bit because I'm going to set it aside and bake it. So I add the chicken broth and then I add my bag of stuffing. I used the whole bag and we didn't have enough chicken broth in here so what I do is I just keep adding the chicken broth until the, the stuffing mix is, is moist enough. And you can decide how moist you want it. I don't like it too mushy. And I leave it soak into the moisture for a little bit because the bread absorbs the, the chicken broth and the egg mix. And I set this aside while I'm cooking this at the same time. So this is what the stuffing mixture is looking like. It's still a little bit cube, not too mushy, kind of in between. And now that I have everything fried up, and I'm going to add the stuffing to this mixture. And you're going to mix it really well to get the flavor from the sausage and the veggies all into your stuffing mix. And then I'm going to add some almond slices and some dried cranberry to the mixture. You can't have enough flavor. Coming from the Caribbean, our food is probably always over seasoned and we like more flavor than less. About this many cranberries and sliced nuts. And after it's all mixed, I'm going to put it in a baking dish I make this mixture the day before Thanksgiving. I put it in the dish, put it in the fridge, and then on Thanksgiving morning, I stick it in the oven at 300 for like 45 minutes. So now I have it all together in the baking dish. This is what it looks like. And tomorrow I will cover it and bake it for 45 minutes on 300. 
this might not be the most healthiest uh, stuffing recipe but it will be one of the most delicious stuffing recipes that you will have and happy thanksgiving everyone if this stuffing recipe is helpful to you and you like this video don't forget to give us a thumbs up leave us a comment subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you will not miss our weekly videos Thank you.